Okay, so it is only right that I let you know that you are currently balancing on a Doc Martin. Let's move on. Hello, welcome back. If you haven't subscribed already, go ahead and like, do that, thumbs up, blah, 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 all the other YouTube stuff. Let's just get right into the tea, okay? I was listening to the full coverage podcast with Manny MUA and Laura Lee, and let me tell you something, baby. Okay, so they had a guest, Joey Graceffa. We, we know Joey. We, we fans. I've even done a video. Go check it out. Okay, so... When I saw that he was going to be on there, I already had a feeling. I was like, they're probably going to ask him about Gabby Hanna situation. And I was like, okay, okay, okay. I'm going to listen and I'm going to listen carefully. Because as soon as her name pop up, as soon as her name pop up, baby, I'm going to be ready. Anyways, okay. So if you don't know what happened with Gabby and Joey some months ago, Go recap on that and then maybe come back here because this might make more sense. But just a little piece of something. Gabby made a video about Joey, about her experience on his show, Escape the Night. In retaliation, Joey made a video saying that Gabby uh, was exaggerating and that's not actually what happened. And not only did Joey make this video saying that Gabby was not being truthful, there was a lot of other cast members that came out against Gabby and it was this big thing and everybody turned against Gabby and y'all know how I feel about people turning against Gabby. Okay, so. So I'm listening to the little podcast, you know, and so of course it comes up. Joey, how do you feel about the Gabby situation and da 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 And baby, when I tell you I tuned in, when I tell you I tuned in, because I was ready to fight. You know, some celebrities and some influencers, you be ready to fight behind and Gabby Hanna was one of them. Now look, don't get me wrong. We respect Joey too. I made video about Joey. I've made videos about Hannah. But y'all know I love me some Hannah. And as my girl, she can do no wrong. You know what I'm saying? So I'm listening. And Joey gave a very good, like a very nice PR answer. You know, he he was very, uh, I hate that that happened. But I hope that we can be friends in the future. He was, he was very that. He tried to keep it cute and keep it classy. I was like, okay. Okay, you knew not to come in here and talk crazy because you would have came in here talking crazy with my girl. Then maybe I would have had to roll up and then the other one. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> and Laura Lee was like, you know, I don't really know Gabby like that. Now, Manny, Laura, and Joey are all really kind of pretty close friends, you know. So it, you wouldn't blame Laura and Manny for kind of siding with Joey because that's their friend and they don't really know gabby like that the way joey wants it joey and and gabby used to be kiki you know more or less so but even laura was very neutral and was like you know i don't i hate that all of that happened but i will say gabby was the only person who stood by me when we went through that whole drama now i don't know if y'all remember all the drama that went down with laura lee and manny uh once upon a time that was all that was like two or three years ago now but boy oh boy was that a showdown and everyone hated them just just straight up hated them and it was really bad and so it says a lot that gabby was still very supportive of laura and therefore laura in this moment in this instance was like you know what i'm not no shade to her i hate that that happened and um i hope that y'all can be friends again but you know what gabby was the only person that stood up for me and laura was like i'm glad joey that you can see a future for maybe you and gabby being able to get on good terms again okay so everybody was cool laura laura was okay she answered why i'm like okay laura you kept it cute joey kept it cute and then here come manny manny look manny i love you so much but I was getting vibes like you was trying to draw some drama out of Joey. Now, Joey didn't already answer your question. And Manny just kept on just, what do you want out of him? It was like Manny wanted Joey to sit up here and be like, And when Joey wasn't giving that, Manny just couldn't let it go. And I was just like, why are you being messy? What does this really have to do with you anyway? And then not only that, I feel like Manny was really trying hard to get on season five of Escape the Night. And I'm just like, baby, calm down. Like, 
if he wants you to be on season five, if there's going to be a season five, then you will be on season five. Like, relax. Like, Manny's energy throughout this, throughout that episode was just kind of off. Did anybody else sense that? It was a little, it was a little off for me. Now I know Manny was dating somebody. And then now he's not. And sometimes when we go through breakups, we act a little out of character. So I'm going to let him heal and see what his energy he's bringing in the next couple episodes. Because I get it. We all have our human moments. But I was just like, you know, let people answer questions. If they, if he answered it, let it go. If people ain't coming with, the, I don't know if you wanted tea for the show. I don't know if Gabby did something personally to you, which she couldn't have. I don't think. But let it go. Why even bring that up? That was so long ago. Everybody's moved on. And then and, and, and it got to the point where Lord, like, literally had to say, okay, well, let's just move on to the next question. Like, Joe is trying to stay out of the drama. Laura's trying to stay out of the drama. And Manny, you just trying to get people to, like, what are you, like, baby, what are you doing? What are you doing? It's giving, you're trying to be in the drama again. It's giving, you're trying to start drama again in three, four, five. Like, what are you doing? Anyways, I just thought the energy was off, but I always want to come on and say, baby, you know, as soon as, soon as somebody said Gabby Hanna, as soon as somebody said her name, I was like, huh? Who? She, what, huh? Speak up? Okay, that's what, I, that's what I thought. Anyways, can we just all get along? Anyways, um, yeah, so that's all I just wanted to come in here and say. If you listen to full coverage, the podcast with Laura Lee and Manny MUA, let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Or if you just want to chime in with your thoughts, please also let me know there. Come find me on all of my other social media. I love you so much. Thank you for watching. And uh, I will see you in the next video. Thank you. Guys. Oh, also. Also. I will be going live on TikTok, so let me know what is a good time for you guys for me to go live on the TikTok, because I finally got enough followers on the talk that I can go live, and I've already gone live a few times, and let me tell you, I can get used to it. Going live on the talk. <laughs> anyway, so, uh, yeah, I will see you little TikTokers in the next episode, and may the odds forever be in your favor. Love you so much. Goodbye.